Well, it's Christmas Day. Merry Christmas from Blue Barrel. Um, and it's raining. So I thought I'd show you our rain barrels as they um, fill up for the season. So we've got vegetable garden here. Not much to look at right now. Some winter plants and cover crops planted in the far beds. And then here's our trusty eight barrel system. So, this is actually collecting from a pretty small segment of our roof, but we had room for the barrels here. If you've seen my other videos, you've seen on the other side of the fence, we have um, three more barrels collecting from a different downspout. So the water comes down the downspout and then it's actually pouring through this downspout diverter. See that? Um, and we have this screen here. Um, in my other videos, you've seen the leaf eater, but we don't really have trees hanging over this segment of the roof, so we skip the leaf eater and just use this little screen. Um, and you can see we're about halfway full. That little black ticker here is halfway between the full and the empty. You can hear the water going in. And then at half full, you'll see the water comes out real strong here. Hold on. Oh yeah. Okay, so that's plenty of pressure to feed a gravity-fed drip line, and we have lots of info about that at bluebarrelsystems.com. All of these barrels are plumbed underneath, so that means they're actually all filling at the same time. That one downspout diverter serves all eight barrels in the system, and we did put an extra outlet on this side so that we can irrigate in both directions. And then, let's see, here we go. Here's an elevated spigot for bucket filling. That's how we fill our watering cans. And then just for fun, on the other side of the house, we've got um, seven more barrels. And again, no real trees overhanging this segment. So we didn't use a leaf eater. We've got the same downspout diverter here. Eventually I will attack this to the wall to stabilize it, but even if it's sagging, it still works. Um, and listen to this. And when I lift it, you can really hear all that water going in there. So um, seven barrels on this side and similar, you see we got the irrigation connection there and then a raised spigot here for filling buckets. And we did stick another spigot on here. So real flexible design, as many barrels as you want, fills from one downspout. Um, and you can stick the spigots wherever you want them. Our DIY rain kits are really flexible like that. We give you all the pieces you need. You get to choose um, exactly where you put everything. So again, all this stuff is at bluebarrelsystems.com, DIY kits and the barrels available for local pickup all over the USA. Thanks very much.